Mr. Spore, if you please come forward and um, give us your name for the record. You have three minutes to speak. And thank you very much for being here with us today. And we appreciate you spending your time with us, sir. Please proceed. Hello, board. Uh, my name is Roger Score, and uh, I'm here to address who's influencing you. Where does your money come from? We hear all these rumors, and boy, they're hot on the trail. They're going to prove our president, his election was influenced by Russia. Well, I don't see people from Russia Russia and across our border. I don't see a lot of people from Russia here over here selling heroin to our children. I don't see a lot of people from Russia coming over here and being involved in the sex trade. But I do see you people protecting open borders. The border that allowed 90% of the heroin to come into this country. The drugs that killed over 72,000 Americans last year. I do see you lobbying for that. So, I want to know, whose interests do you have at heart? Do you have the American people's heart at interest? I heard you last time I was here claiming that people on government assistance, that their checks were going to be delayed. And it's going to be hard times for them. I see the media crying out that federal employees are getting a delayed paycheck. They try to say they're not getting their check. Well, they're getting a check. It's just delayed. But the 36 workers that are supposed to be fixing our roads Instead of getting a paycheck, you buy a bowling alley. You put over $25 million worth of our tax money towards a Giffords Memorial downtown. He gave her husband millions of dollars for his flight to nowhere, his balloon debacle. Steve Christie got a golf course out in Green Valley. These people ain't got food on their table, and our roads ain't getting fixed. So I want to know, whose interest do you have at hand? You can afford to pay a lobbyist to go to Phoenix, to the Capitol, and attempt to raise the sales tax on us to kill more jobs in this community so more people ain't got a paycheck on their table, so then they get involved in selling drugs sex trafficking, to feed their families. But what about me? What do you got for me, the American citizen, the taxpayer? Who do you represent? You've used up all your time, Mr. Score. Thank you for Thank being you. here with us today. 